Welcome back. All morning, we have been going in-depth on this controversial story. Stuart Chaffetz, the father of a 10-year-old boy with autism, secretly recorded what he claims were teachers bullying his son. His tapes are shocking and disturbing. Listen to this. Did you go to see any books in the library, or you just looked at sculptures? Oh, okay, you are. We spoke with him earlier about why he decided to wire his son. When you hear your child in distress and you can't be there to protect them, it's the worst feeling in the world. Uh, one of the reasons why I went forward was, was to, to one day show him that people cared, that what they did to him was wrong, in addition to hopefully reaching out and, and showing what an epidemic bullying is. You know, and, they, and what was especially vile about this situation is that all the children in that class were, uh, had uh, verbal impairments, so none of them could tell their parents and they just ran, and, and the staff ran wild saying whatever they wanted, venting on these children, uh, which to me is the ultimate act of a coward when you pick on someone who can not only not fight back, but can't talk back. And my son actually did learn to fight back, and he was really a message to me saying, saying help. It was a cry. The Cherry Hill, New Jersey school district says none of the teachers involved work for them anymore. One of the accused teachers says the claims against her are disingenuous. So after hearing about this story, we did some research and found that the use of spy equipment by concerned parents isn't as uncommon as you might think. HLN digital lifestyle expert Mario Armstrong is joining me now to talk about this. And good morning. Yes, good morning. Good you to got see your you. hands on some of these pretty cool gadgets that, that people are using. Um, are you, by the way, are you recording me right now? Anything I, I, I need to know? I am recording you right now, but I'm not going to tell. <laughs> You're making them, I'm me not, nervous. I'm not going to tell the viewers how I'm doing that. We'll, uh, okay. we'll reveal that a little bit later in the segment, okay. so keep watching. But All right. So what do you have? Here's the thing. I'm a parent myself. I have a nine-year-old son, Christopher. I get concerned about him on things that he's doing as well. So I'm going to show you a couple of things. One of which I've actually used. Now, many of these gadgets come from a company called Brickhouse Security, which a lot of people don't know. You can walk right in, buy these things online, and pick these things up, anywhere ranging from 50 bucks and up. This right here is a GPS locator. So what I can actually do is I can put this in my kid's backpack. He went on a field trip. I put this in Christopher's backpack, and I could actually monitor. I could cookie crumb him through my cell phone and actually see on a map where he is at any given moment. Wow. If I was a parent, I'd do that every day. I, it's, <laughs> I would do it. <laughs> just so you know. No, just so you know. You're right. 199 bucks is not cheap, and then you have to pay a monthly service for the oh, GPS okay. fee. So that gets a little expensive, but you can also use this for teen driving. You can put this in the car. You could get an alert mm. if your child drives over a certain speed limit. Ooh. So a lot of smart uses for the smart GPS. So teens out there, do what you're supposed to behind okay, the wheel. Okay, good mom to and dad know. Be tracking. What else you have? Alarm clocks. Now this could be great for, say, elderly care, or you know, I have an aging grandmother, or say for uh, a child, child care, maybe nanny camp type of thing. This is an alarm clock. And when you plug it in, it works like a regular and it has alarm a camera clock. In? And it has a camera, but you can't see it. You might be able to see real closely inside there. Oh, yeah. That you can yep. see there's a little lens, but it works, it buzzes, it shows up just like regular time. You would never know Great there's a camera nanny inside cam. there. Yeah. Great for nanny cam. Now, you can't put this in the nanny's room. So if the nanny, let's say, lives with you or oh. something like that, it can't go right. into her room, right. but it can go into common areas or into your kid's room. Okay, the glasses. The, the glasses, yes. I mean, come on. These are like total spy. <laughs> the camera is right here in the front. Now, what's interesting about this uh, pair of glasses is not only can it record video, but it can also record audio separately. So you can do just video or just audio, and you can even shoot images with a touch of a button. Mm. Okay, so, and what about oh, well, gonna you put, put these those on? on? Yeah, because, you know, they look like, I don't know if I would really wear you them for my style, but... <laughs> Okay, I look and, more uh, than I usually do. <laughs> what about this pen? Yes, the pen. So, looks like a regular pen, and it actually, I'm going to uh, roll it out here, actually does write. It has a oh, ballpoint. It does, okay. it does write, but and it we has know it a records. camera. We know it records, yeah. and we know because you were using yeah, it. Yeah, I actually tried this out. This is pretty funny. I tried this out yesterday um, on Don Lemon, who was in the newsroom sitting near us. Check this out. Okay. You better okay. tell me quick because I'm recording you right now. Okay. So that's you're not, good. Doesn't that surprise you? No, it's in the pen. No, it doesn't surprise me on the news. I see the lens. You're not surprised? Why do you think I did that whole thing about I'm working on? I saw him and I looked here. It's right. I the lens is you're right not surprised. there. You blew it. Why would I be surprised? <laughs> He's wait. I'm turning it around. He's not surprised at all. Wow, you did great for turning that around. There's I no monitor or anything on this Wait, device. He, so it's, he, he pointed right at it. Yeah, well, it was hard for right you there. to kind of record him, too, because you were kind of talk to yeah. him while you were holding the pen. He was pretending pen. he was working for the camera. But I have an idea that would have worked a little bit smarter for, for that situation. In my shirt, as you can see right here, Ooh. this little black button. Now, it would be helpful if I had other black buttons, maybe, but yeah. <laughs> this is a camera inside of this button, 
which actually connects to this device here, oh, which wow. I would just plug into and I have a little screen so I could actually see. And everything gets put right onto your little memory cards or things like that. So there's a camera right here in this my This is tricky stuff, but now I look at all this and some yes. of it can be pretty costly. Um, can your iPhone and other devices do what, what this does? It can do some of it at yeah, least? Absolutely, you can do the video recording, but it becomes a little obvious if you're trying, unless you're going to situate the phone somewhere and maybe cover it with something. But the other thing is you really need to be around it. Some of these devices actually have remote control options. Ooh. So you don't have to be with the device. You can just turn it on or turn it off with the remote. This is very James Bond-esque. Very James Bond-esque <laughs> at an affordable <laughs> price. And I was really shocked to find how many parents are really concerned about everything from their teens to yeah, elderly yeah. parents that they're trying to take care of and make sure they're getting good care to their kids. And, so, and even spouse abuse and things like that. I mean, mm -hmm. I'm finding some people are, you know, women need to be, make sure, check your cars, make sure that this thing isn't right. in your device if you're in a tough situation at home. Is there a lot of software too that you can use? I mean, this is a lot of hardware. This is a lot of hardware. That's a great point because software you really can't see. Mm -hmm. So there are things called key loggers. So if you're really in a bad relationship or a tough relationship, I'd really look at to it look into your computer and uncover whether or not you have any key logging software. What it does is it actually uh, captures every single stroke and click and it can remotely email that. So let's say I go online and I'm looking for a, um, a domestic violence abuse center to help mm -hmm. me. So I'm scanning for stuff. Well, if, if I was a, a bad husband or somebody like that, you know, I could get an email every 30 minutes sending me what emails Knowing you're doing, what, what chats you're oh, doing, wow. what websites you've been Ooh. to, and I can find out, oh, you're trying to get more information about how to leave me or something like that. So it's very, very important. We're talking hmm. about good uses right. of this technology, and I would do the same thing that parent did if there was a problem right. with my kid in school, so but we have to be aware of the dark side What was your well. favorite? You've tried them all out? Uh, the pen was shockingly crisp <laughs> video. HD was yeah. phenomenal video. Even all the video folks here said, wow. And you know, when CNN video folks say, wow, about a camera and a yeah. pen, that's pretty impressive. Yeah, they're so. not easily wowed. No, not at all. I've tried. <laughs> Look at Don. Poor Don. We're just abusing him this morning. He's loving it. He'll be on later exactly. today. He'll he probably, oh stuff. yeah, I know. You, you should have seen him when I came over. He said, he said the only reason he knew something was up was because I never talked to him in the newsroom. So <laughs> that's when he knew something was is up. Is that true? <laughs> it is true. But you know, that's it. We're busy. We're very well, busy. You know, I mean, this is really great that you're showing this serious issue accessible technology could really change people's lives. And what's yeah. happening in that classroom is happening in classrooms yeah. across no, the country, unfortunately. And I love my teachers, but hey, bad apples, we got to get them yeah. out. Mario, this was fantastic. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Thank really, you. I hope really it helped good. a lot of people. Great having you here in studio.